excuse me. Hi and welcome back to Leslie Crafts. Today I'm going to do a quick little project which I am following hashtag um, don't freak out before Christmas. Um, I can see me doing a lot of these paper clips. They are ingenious. Um, I'm not too sure if Dee Dee um, came up with them on her own or if she saw somebody do them but I can tell you um, once you learn how to do these, they are great with journals, TNs, um, notepads, diaries, anything. Honestly, they are so quick and simple to do. And um, yeah, I absolutely love them. And I'll be just putting them into this TN um, just for a little bit of a difference and um, to try and do different things within here. So without further ado I'm just going to move that I've already cut out my pieces but I haven't you know totally finished them so you need two little bits of card and these are one and three quarters by two and one quarter and then um, you can just round the corners just so they're a little bit easier to get in and out and then this one is two and one eighths by one and a half there we go you need a paper clip and then you need a small strip of fabric and this measures um, oh yeah two and a half by one and a half I thought I lost some measurement then but I haven't so yeah so that's for you a little bit of fabric or hesitant ribbon, whatever you've got on hand. And then you need three pieces, which are five inches by one and three quarters. And then put them all together and then make your flag. So I just cut up to the middle and then just make my flag pieces. And then I just space them out like that. Just to give, you know, thing or you know um you know change it about and stuff like that and then i'm putting my paper clip so it is on the right hand side rather than left so you can do it either way and then this is just for me to know where i can so you just fold them over try and get them aligned you can always cut off a little bit of overhang if it don't play ball just get your bone folder and just sort of score it at the top there we go so it will look something like that then I take my paper clip off and then I take the bottom piece and the top piece and then what we want to do is we want to glue down here and down there and down there but we want to keep this side open so get your um, white glue, whatever glue you want to use and then just make sure that it's the right size you're doing. There we go. And then where the fold line is I just pop it on and then I'm going to just make sure that it's all glued, oops, all glued together. And then once it's dried, I go back and I rub off all the excess glue. And then I do the same to this little bit. So again, we want to glue down here and there. So I, this is the easiest way for me that I have found. Dee Dee does it differently and I'm sure other people who are doing her weekly challenges or daily every three days uh, will be doing it slightly different as well. Um, so yeah. So there we go. Just get the excess off. And then I'm just going to get my scissors and I'm just going to trim off 
my badly designed cutting so just sits a little bit straight up. I've got my hot glue on so I'm hoping by the time I need it it be it will be done. So just give a paper clip on and make sure that you catch all three pieces because they're sort of sticking up. There we go. Right, just need to just trim that look a bit better. There we go. Just to make it look nice. Then you just get your fabric, you just fold it over and then you just pop it in there. And what I do is I take a pen, which is going to be roughly the same sort of size I'm going to be gifting. There we go. So I get the thickness of the loop right. And then I staple it. There we go. So I know that's not going to go anywhere. And by the time you do your fab fabric fix or whatever glue you're using, it will be firmly in there. And we will be decorating this look a bit. So let's see if my hot glue is hot enough. There you go. When I just put down my hot glue, I need another stick quickly. There we go. These will be great for craft fairs and selling them with a little pen because obviously the teacher little gifts and stuff like that, these will be perfect. And there we go. So this will just fit into, I'm just going to grab a page in my TN. So they're going to fit in like that. And then the pen. Oops. Will just fit in. And there we go. And then you can open it up to exactly where you want to be writing. And there's your sort of your book page marker and your pen. So we're gonna just decorate this little bit, but obviously have to do sort of flat. So um well as flat as we can do it. So I'm just gonna have a little cat, I think. And it's just gonna say candy time so there we go and I'm just doing hot glue so it's a little bit quicker but you know look how quickly you can do them and it's all done from scraps so it hits quite nicely with um, scraps and things so you know so it's perfect to go with projects. If you're doing like um, quick little notebooks, you know, and you've got spare uh, paper left over, how quick, how quick is these just to do? And there you go. So that's one quick little bookmark. So, you know, so we can put this in any of the pockets of TN. So I'm just going to have this one in here, and I will be adding a pen in later. But, but how cute is that little bookmark there? And you can add a pen. Obviously, you can do, you know, do them, do several of them, and I've got these stick these in. You know, do several of them and everything else. So yeah, you know, just adds a little bit more feature, and it just adds as a page took as well, so you know exactly which page you're on, and everything else. But without adding more bulk to it, I really love. I really love this little thing, and. I can see me making lots more, especially in scrap week and especially in, I think we've got a banner week. 
so yeah so that is a banner on a page on a thing and all you need to add is some material or ribbon or whatever you've got handy so yeah so um don't forget just if you want to have a look at um even more inspiration just put a hashtag um df i remember i always remember the letters and it's really easy hashtag dfbc um it's already on my um um description so if you put that you'll see everybody's ideas and dds as well and um, you can pick and choose or follow along okay bye now